so good morning guys i hope you are all well today um so first day vlogging um i don't know why i've left the talking pit till i got in the car but i just knew i would not have time this morning i was like wake up at seven leave at eight go to work and what time did i wake up 20 past seven what time did i leave 10, 10 past eight i always give myself buffer time because i'm just never quite bang on so i always give myself like a 15 minute buffer so i'm still on time so it's fine um if i'm way ahead of time classes don't start until 9 30 and it's 8 15 it's only in town oh we're out of focus there we go um yeah it's only in town which is like 20 minutes from me especially on a saturday morning probably even 15 minutes so i don't know why i'm panicking but just need to get there and this is like my first week of work really um so basically i've got a new job as a reformer pilates teacher which is so cool um working at the reformer studio in nottingham currently at the lace market one but they have um loads of studios so they have one in lace market in town um obviously this is for nottingham based people who know nottingham um one on derby road um one in west brishford one in derby and one in loughborough um so yeah currently at the lace market one um just because i don't know i think it's the most um what am I trying to say here? Get your words out. Basically, people need a covering this week and that's just the one that's come free. Um, so yeah, on my way. And these studios, you have to open up and close them yourself. And this is the first time I've ever had a job. Oh my goodness, the focus. There we go. Um, yeah, this is the first time I've ever this is the first time I've ever had a job that um, requires me to open and close. And I don't mind opening, I did it the other day, but closing, it's just stress. I just want to make sure I do a good job and actually close everything and lock it properly. Um, so yeah, um, getting there just early just so I can suss everything out. And yeah, I'm excited. I have three classes today. First class is a hit one, second one's a body, and then the last one's a foundation. So it goes from like hard to easy in my brain. So that's all good. But yeah, I just wanted to jump on and have a chat first thing this morning. Also, I keep looking in the viewfinder, not the camera, because it keeps going fuzzy for some reason. It's not the best tripod. Um, it's actually just one that holds my phone, but I thought I'd give it a go and let it hold my camera. And so far, kind of so good. Um, but, what was I saying? Yeah, so I just thought I'd jump on. This is my first vlog in ages. And I think I'm really excited to start vlogging because obviously I've retired from gymnastics now and my life's so different. I feel like I can be open, I can be myself. I can chat about what I want to chat about. Um, whether it's past gymnastics experience, what I'm doing right now, so PTing and now teaching reformer, um, like mental health, anxiety, just it's just going to be really raw and honest. Like if I'm having a bad day, oh, sorry, this fucking focus. Like if I'm having a bad day, I can actually say, like. I was looking through some of my old vlogs when I tried to start vlogging in, oh, I can't even remember when now, like 2020. And they were just so, it was just fake. Like I was going through a lot. It was COVID, I was injured. Um, obviously a lot of people know my brother passed away. Um, then I didn't make the Olympics all on the same day. Um, and I've kind of digressed that a little bit but not loads and then life was just really messy um so my life has changed so much um 
and I just feel like I can talk about things open and honestly now and not sugarcoat anything like so yeah I'm excited to share things with you guys I guess um so yeah it's gonna be very cool and I think this new path I'm on is just I don't know I think it's pretty perfect for me like I've really been enjoying my online coaching um and there's so many days I go back and forth like am I doing the right thing am I not doing the right thing uh, but I think that's just natural from being in a sport for like 20 years and if this goes out of focus one more time again yeah so I think it's just natural for being in a sport for 20 years and literally having your life scheduled almost for you like competitions are put in place you work towards them you get them done whereas now I'm self-employed um, I'm my own boss I create my own timetable every single day um, which I absolutely love I don't know if it it's like a forever thing that I want to continue doing because I do sometimes like having people tell me what to do a little bit um, but right now like from having such a structured 20 years to having the flexibility it's just ugh, so refreshing and so nice um, so yeah for for right now I'm absolutely loving it and I'm really just going with the flow with everything but as I was going with that um, yeah I think starting to work at the reformer studio I, I just think like the whole team like I've been meeting everybody like officially this week and everybody's just been so lush so helpful um, and I just think it can open a lot of doors for me um, yesterday we had a really exciting day and hopefully soon I can maybe tell you what it is it's not written in stone yet is that what I'm saying set in stone um, but I think it could be almost a defo thing to look forward to so that's really really cool um, but yeah for now I'm going to work I'm excited this camera keeps shifting down and defocusing but um, yeah, I'm a little bit stressed, but it's fine. I'm excited and yeah, let's go teach some classes. So I thought I'd just give you a little tour of the studios. So we've got some lovely pictures there. That's just um, there's some of the instructors working. There's some of the Paralympic athletes that come here. Um, they do pre and postnatal classes, so some of some of the babies. And yeah, it's just really cute. And then here's the studio. So we've got 10 reformers in here, I think. And then obviously your boxes, your rings, your balls, fairy lights, my favorite part. And yeah, it's just a, such a cute studio. Very, very lucky to be working in here. Yeah, I just thought I would jump on before class. I've just had a little quick run through of the session plans and stuff. So we plan all of the sessions ourselves, which is cool because we can get creative. So I just keep my little notebook here because I have the memory of a fish and I'm just not going to remember the whole class. Although generally when you get in a flow, you're actually not too bad, but it's more just because I'm still learning so much, um, remembering all like the tensions of the springs for each exercise and stuff like that. Because um, all the exercises are different. Um, so yeah, got my 9.30 class. Got like 20 minutes till it starts. Um, 
hit class first. So yeah, I'm excited. When you get in Becky's car. So when are you get in Becky's car, why did you turn it off? So, huh? There's no chocolate in this. Why is there chocolate? I thought it was just coffee and clot of cream. No, it's fudge. She's not happy. <laughs> So we're on our way to Meadow Hall. We're just having a little sister shopping trip. What do we want to get? We want some Uggs. And we're having, oh my God, have you seen all these TikToks? The black, that, um, the black ones, there's quite a few around. I've, had, I've looked online. The, the sandy ones, I ain't, got, I ain't got a chance. There's some in Manchester, yeah. in Shoe. In Manchester? That's, that's literally <laughs> the only place on, online that had them. And I was thinking, I'm sure I asked Alex to go. Nah, it's, um, it's better to look in person <clears throat> because random places like JD and like you call it shoe, I call it scoo. Um, like have them. I and there's an put, office. I had like a scoo. Scoo. Yeah, yeah, the day, yeah. Like yeah. None. But, but um, yeah, yeah we want some Uggs. Like. So that's our aim. And yeah, I was gonna say, have you seen all these TikToks that's like on about girl math and how like? Oh my god, hilarious! Oh, that's it's me. So funny. The, the, the one that resonated seen... the most with me was cash is free. Yes, yes. <laughs> absolutely, one hundred percent. It is cash is free. Have you seen the one that was about? Um, I need to get a tripod. I think I've watched my arm. Something. Um, it's about a I girl buying a Dyson well, Air wrap. Yeah, and it's <laughs> the Australian ones, and it's like um, I don't, I don't even want to do the accent. But it's like, how did you justify that? And it's like, well, like a blow dry cost me, God knows what a week. And the air up cost me like $690. So in theory, I'm making money because I could go get a blow dry every week. <laughs> so that's our thoughts today. Um, we're going to justify everything we spend probably. So cheers. Starby's en route. Beck doesn't approve of hers. It's not but terrible, I got, it's just screaming. I got a pink. It, it hasn't got fudge in it. 100% it said fudge and it's got, it looks dark <laughs> on the posters of where and there's any fucking fudge in it. <laughs> I got a pink refresher because it's far too late in the day to have a coffee and be bouncing off the walls. So we're gonna, sh oh gosh, I just went to speak and if it came out. So we're gonna shop and we're just gonna have a sister evening. So, we've done the shopping. It was a success, I think. Um, what did you even get? Did I get? Yeah. Um, Pinstripe trousers, tracky Kamsara, shirt Kamsara. Ew. Oh, <laughs> look old. Oh. <laughs> Ew. A notebook, which I made any by for me. Which was three stuff. I found a really cool hat in this random little, what do you call it? Not a DIY shop, stationery. Oh shit, I've just zoomed in so much. Yeah, I found a cool hat in this stationery shop that she threw on a £2.50 um, diary. How dare she? But um, we've come to Wags. I went for picky bits today. Got a little bit of pork buns, tamar squid. If you've never been to Wags, get a tamar squid and then chicken, gyozas. Yeah, we're just gonna eat. And Becky was healthy. Got a little salmon, teriyaki bowl. So yeah, just gonna scrub. Hi, like I said, just woke up. Done my morning routine. Had my ginger shots. Had my turmeric shots. Had my actimel. Made my coffee. It's over there. Having lots of water as soon as I wake up. This is also a fake Stanley. It was like 15 pounds off Amazon, um, which was cool. I actually want a purple Stanley, like a real one. Um, but what was I saying? Yeah, so today, like I said, I was gonna go to the gym and I haven't. So I might just do like a mini Pilates style workout thing in my room now because I need to move. Like I said, I've not been to the gym for two days, so I do feel really stiff. Um, <clears throat> and I've got just some clients to catch up with on here and my online coaching. And then I am meeting my friends at Half One. 
and we're going for lunch and it's just going to be nice and sunny well it is a really sunny day actually if you take a peek outside it's really nice so yeah we're going for lunch and we're going to a, just like a nice like outdoory place so that'll be cool and i think we're booking wireless festival for next year already and i've never been to a festival and they both say well my friend amber she's been to wireless loads of times so she recommended that um so yeah how exciting getting dates in the diary for 2024 already yeah it's um it's very good but um yeah i'm gonna sit and reply to these clients see what they've been up to and yeah then i'll start getting ready i feel like i'm not gonna fit in a mini workout this morning so it may have to be this evening but i just need to do some form of stretching so yeah I will probably take you to lunch with the girls because they actually bang on about me vlogging all the time. So they might be happy about it or they might not. So who knows? Yeah, literally. Cody, you're Gone going to Goose, introduce yourself. Here are the girls. Hello, I'm from Lucy. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> they like to call me Goose. <laughs> um, it's just a so <laughs> Name, age. 23. Almost my birthday in a long, two and a half weeks. 17 days. 17 days. Big 24. Big 24. Oh, yeah, decent. <laughs> <laughs> what did you have for lunch today? I had a pizza. I, pizza. I shouldn't eat anything else with a pizza. I'm being. That's a bit close. No, you're not that close. Hi. Amber. Yeah, I can see you. 24. Can you plug your um, Amber Jax. <laughs> A-M-B-A-J-X. <laughs> um, did have soft shell prawn tacos um, and normal chips and a Coke Zero. Health as well. And it was nice, but it could have been a big portion. Yeah, it was a bit small, wasn't it? Oh, it was. but we're just having a nice girls' lunch and watching the footy. That wasn't planned. But, um, we wanted to sit outside and there was only the football on. We prefer music, but, you know, it is what it is. Lucy's so lucky now! <laughs> Do you know what the hardest part is to not look at yourself? In uh, that, yeah. and you might look in the camera. I have told them about my new hat, and I like it. I'm a believer. And yeah, it's really hot, it's really sunny. We're getting a bit sweaty over here, but we want a dessert. What are we thinking? I want a baked well tart. I think I want that lemon posset. I think I want some ice cream. <laughs> You're such a basic. Bitch. There I am. Basic <laughs> but yeah, we're just having a girls' day in the sun and sweating a bit but it's cool it's all good all right <laughs> i can't even see myself i was trying to just vlog us chatting but welcome yeah, i can, I can chit chat you, you can make a feature if you want you, you can't get in my shirt well no <laughs> oh you can if i slump a little bit bye are you recording? Yeah! Well, oh. that's probably such a boob shot. Sky Sports coverage of the Premier League. Welcome to the Tootie Crew. Look how weird we all look now. <laughs> well, this is how people do it. How else do people do it? I wonder what flavours they'll have for ice cream. <laughs> do you not say on the menu? Uh, what are you having? No, just an app. I'm getting a bake the... world sack. Then I'm going to be put on the spot. I don't know. Bake world sack, so you can tappy put it in. It's off. It's off. <laughs> but it's not very often you get a baked cold tart on them. No, they are. And it's a seasonal. I don't know what mm. seasonal is. going to come out of the Hot iPhone, chocolate fondant. Don't you shake that table too much. That camera flies off the back. How are you doing that? You are? Come on. <laughs> 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 so it doesn't. Oh. <laughs> no, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's your. I might like, get a link to poacher cheese. What? Apple and pickled walnut chutney and sourdough bread. <laughs> what the fuck are you reading? <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know whether white chocolate cheesecake or lemon posset. <laughs> oh. oh, make me laugh. Let's make sure I'm in the shop. It's quite good. I'm, I'm, I'm not actually in the shop. Dog, I don't yeah. mind. You are. You're not right. Ready I need my Pepsi. Uh, what? Yeah, I want my soda lime. 
this is taking us just terrible. Yeah. 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 Yes, please. I think yeah. so, yeah. Can I get a bake roll tart, please? Yeah. Is it? Can I get it with ice cream and not clot cream? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Thank you. No can I get the lemon posset, please? Yeah. Thank you. Um, what ice cream sorbet base you have? Uh, it's mango, raspberry, and lemon. Do you know what I'd have up the air first? Yeah, yeah thank you. <laughs> oh, great. Yeah, I get three scoops. All right. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Thank you. So I, right. can't <laughs> I can't believe it's three o'clock. Is it? Yeah, it's the only thing I've done today is woke up. Yeah, I've had too long with you already. <laughs> it's been too long with us. Yeah, it's been long two hours. <laughs> an hour and a half, actually, not even two. <laughs> the pain. God, Get yourself back. back with you, man. Yeah. <laughs> I, want, I, want, I want to go on a dog walk. I feel like you two are going to have a boyfriend soon. I'm panicking. No. We've cut it. Right, we're not. Oh, yeah, he is actually. Hi, right, thank you. Yeah, he yeah. actually is. Oh, get in there. Oh, I'm going to turn the vlogging camera off right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to dab it. Yes. My, ice my ice cream's cream. melting. Here's the. Big well tart with some crumbs. I think I've got the best dessert. No, no lie. Lemon posse. You're still going to be hungry after I'm that. <laughs> yeah, bravo, but lemon posse. <laughs> so I am just jumping back on to round off this vlog, even though I think I filmed it almost two weeks ago now. But that doesn't matter. Um, just hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, it was just a little bit of a weekend with me, a um, bit of time with my friends, a little bit of work and a little bit of time with Becky. Um, so let me know um, if you liked it or didn't like it in the comments below and if you want to see anything else. Um, I'd love to like dive a little bit more into like what it's been like post gymnastics retirement and um, kind of stepping into the new world and how I found my feet and the ups and downs of it um, and yeah just a little bit more into that but I talked a little bit about it at the start of the video so um, again just let me know um, if any of you guys want to hear about that or if you'd like a Q&A or just anything really um, I just want to take you guys along I guess a little bit on this journey post-retirement because um, I've done some really exciting things this year and I almost wish I had vlogged them because um, almost experiences that you will, will not never get again but um, very lucky to have done some of the stuff that I have done um, so yeah um, hope you guys enjoyed the video um, hopefully I will do some more soon um, I do have an exciting couple of months coming up um, fingers crossed I never like to speak things into existence until they're set in stone and it's not quite set in stone um, but when it is I will definitely be taking you guys along for the journey because it will be a really really cool one um, so yeah um, hopefully I will catch you all in my next video and a little bit of a welcome back to the channel from me so yeah lots of love bye